What's up, everybody? Loki back here with another gameplay review with the Super Monkey Fighters. Uh, this time it's going to be Atlas Fallen. I know nothing about this game other than the name and that it's technically already been released. So I'm getting a little bit behind on it, but I'm going to check it out and see if we like it, see what you guys think about it, and uh, hope you guys enjoy the ride. So here we go. Okay, that's a lot going on, trying to process. There's uh Take up the gauntlet. Gauntlet. Liberate mankind. Destroy the sun god. Oh, uh, but my is god is the sun? I don't know if I like that. I'm gonna... With rediscovered power comes hmm. hope for humanity. Enslaved for centuries and worshipped at Thanos, uh -huh. you finally have a way to fight back and grow from one of the can unnamed grow. to champion of the people on Atlas. Okay. Are we just generic, nameless, faceless hero? Because seems that way. Magical weaponry and skills that turn enemies to dust again. Seems like a mix of. Don't want to cross the deserts alone. Bring a friend to experience. Why are we sand surfing? Like fart power? Is that what it is? Is it fart power? It's got to be fart power. Maybe I'm back into the game now, Atlas was but not always it looks like Final Fantasy mix. Ruins. Like, it doesn't seem like we traditional high fantasy. It's more Thelos, the sun God, stripped its that kind of a thing, everything. you know? Homes, lives, Fart powered Final homes. Fantasy. That's what this is. They are forced to dig and mine and sift through the wreckage of our world for essence. A magical essence. substance that is raised to his glory. A magically Thelos. generic substance. You are but one among these millions. Yep. Venturing across the sands to deliver essence to the camp. Look at all, you put all that time into creating your character the and then put a helmet over their face. A path for you and humanity. The ability to explore the realm. Nope, fart power. Brimming with things to That's cool again. I'm, I'm down with that. That, that elk was... Who need your help. We've been walking for hours. We haven't been what? We've been walking for hours. So you use your fart power. Fart power, like crossing the land see? with your newfound powers. Fart powered no Final Fantasy. What I tell you? For your discovery, as you explore and empower the gauntlet. That's all I gotta say. Like, there's letting you fly through the air or glide. I don't know what more opinion I can give you on this. Along the way, submerged. You travel through the power of farts. And secrets will beckon you to discover them and restore more of the world. Much has been lost, but maybe not forever. Oh. When you learn, you are um, for a reason, and no one will ever notice one more dead unnamed. Oh, poor Atlas unnamed. That guy seems like a bully. World. And for the rebellious, even more so. Wraiths stalk the land, eager to shape your grave from the endless dunes. Smaller enemies are quickly dispatched with your. Where'd that hammer come from? Just. But Put that out of your prison pocket? The legendary creatures that will bar your way. Each is a massive and terrifying beast that will take all your skill, guile, So it's and more monster hunter. Defeat. Every enemy has weak points, joints, limbs, or other places where the liberal application of force can yield. And they glow results. to let you know exactly where to hit them. Choosing the right ones at the right moments. It's like I've never played a video game before. Thanks for telling me. It's many foes. Uh, that's a big hammer to pull out of that prison pocket. I knew we would cross paths again. Well, a lot has happened, but let's get to someplace safe. The gauntlet means the sands themselves become your weapon. Each strike creates momentum, building to a mighty shatter attack that All right. crushes your foes. This gets more and more. So the shatter attack, or is it a shatter attack? The titanic finale of destructive power. Mix and match the dune cleaver, sand whip, and knuckle dust with more than one knuckle dust. Stones <laughs> to build a playstyle that is truly your own. Pocket sand, pocket sand. Combinations of active and passive skills to experiment with and find the best way to bring down each monster you face. Whether you intend to impale your enemies, live through the most devastating attacks, or unleash aerial combos, there's a style for you. Pocket sand better be a style. That should be a new fighting style in every game. Pocket sand. from smashing parts off your enemies, 
as well as being specifically crafted by you to get the effects you want. From fluid play styles to big hits, perfect to blocks big hits. to dodges and rolls, you determine every part of your build. Exploring and experimenting so, is half the fun. The voice actor doing the narration on this. If that all sounds amazing. Alone, Good job. You're in love. Kudos to you. Atlas Fallen so far, my favorite part of this trailer. For its entire campaign. A satisfying challenge on its own. Co-op fart co power. Is that like human centipede powered fart powers? Are limitless. Yes, this whole thing's going to be just me talking about farts. I'm not going to not talk about farts. So what's going on? They're they're moving through the sand with the power of farts. Rise and That's what it's going to be. In Atlas Fallen, coming soon on PS5, Xbox Series and PC. It's going to be everywhere. So, I don't know what more to say about that. Fart power is good. Fart power is great. I guess there's monsters and stuff and there's a story, but you travel through the power of farts. But hey, Thanks for uh, sticking around if you got this far. Let us know uh, down below what you think about this video. Go check out our other stuff too. It's really good. Trust me. You'll like it or you won't. Then, you know, just go about your merry way. No cost to you. See ya.